was really like a, a dream to play with Jeff because it, it wasn't it wasn't ever anything I thought I would get. Uh, I just tracked him down to try to get an autograph and I gave him a copy of my first CD when I met him. Um, never in my wildest dream because he's, he's always played with keyboard players with his own band and I think the last guitar player he played with was Jimmy Page and the Yardbirds in the 60s. So when he called me up to play I was my mind was absolutely blown. Sometimes I felt intimidated because he's you know most guitar players on earth look up to him as the inventor of most of what is electric guitar today and uh, but his personality is so down to earth and gentle that he was not a taskmaster by any stretch. He's, I mean, after the shows, it's, we had a very similar sense of humor. So <laughs> that worked out well, because it can be grueling on the road, you know, taking bus rides for eight or 10 hours and then having to play after that. Um, it's, it, humor helps you get through it.
I loved being with Michael Jackson. I loved being with Jeff Beck. Um, and I love the music from both of those guys. But at this point, I want to express myself the way I want to express it, which is with my songs. And, um, you know, even with the audience much, much smaller, it's ultimately more satisfying.